All right, so we did a video on the house was empty when I first got it. So I just want to do it now with our stuff in it, just because it's sometimes fun to see. It looks a lot different once there's actually furniture. The living room is a decent size, but our sectional is giant. So it kind of takes up the whole thing and we can only rearrange it this way. But not a huge deal because it's the view out our front window. It's the neighbor's garage, so we're not missing much. And then the dining room and the bar. So we have lots of seating if people want to come visit us. And a rug that doesn't match anything, but it was an extra rug, so we kept it. Laundry room. We already have a different washer and dryer. Because our other ones didn't work right, they had to replace them. But they're still baby ones. British washer and dryers are tiny. And then closets, but not exciting. We'll go upstairs. I didn't really do much with the kids bathroom, just gave them some rugs basically. And Lexi's room, which is like a unicorn explosion. She picked the decorations and bedding and everything. She calls this her chillax corner. She has a full size bed, so, well it doesn't look like she has tons of room. It is a decent sized room. It's just that with that heater on that wall and the closet there, there's not many options for her bed. But it works for her. And then Damien's room. Also a full size bed, but it just seems so much roomier, even though it's technically smaller. And something that Matt didn't show in the other video. And so screens are not common in England, like off base. None of the houses really do screens on the windows. They have them here. They're nice because the windows all open out, but that way, you know, when you don't have the windows open and you want more sun, they just go up there. Calm down. I'll be honest, the reason I didn't want to live off base is because I didn't want to have houses without screens because air conditioning is also not a thing here, so you're going to have windows open a lot. I want screens for the spiders. And Dominic's room. Twin size bed. He also doesn't have it arranged the best, but that's how he wants it so he can sit to play Xbox. So if he had it against the wall, I feel like it would look better, but he's happy with it. It's his room. He can do what he wants. And our room definitely looks bigger once it has the furniture. It's a queen size bed, so plenty of room on either side in my dresser. Matt's is over there with a the TV, because that's where the plug is, this wall, which would make more sense in my opinion. It doesn't have any outlets. And then this is where I have to put my hair stuff because bathrooms in the UK do not have plugs, except for, for uh, electric shavers. They don't have outlets, so you gotta do your hair somewhere else. You can see my sweatshirt. It's Lexi's school sweatshirt. Kind of fun with the American and the British flags. So that's a nice day out right now, too. It's not raining. It's nice and green still. And then our bathroom. And that's our house now that it's furnished.